That's real? She works hard for the money. <laughs> I'm the 14th. I'm the accident of the family. That's wow. what they call me. Yeah. Do you believe that? Good, good accident. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Ellen, are you flirting with Celine? I mean, how could you blame? I think we would all flirt with Celine. I wish I would have known that when I was doing my shoot because I had no idea you could do it <laughs> that way. That was a genuine laugh. Celine did not expect that. She was caught off guard. That was so cute. We got a real genuine belly laugh from her. Hi friends, your buddy Gilbert here with a very special video. Before we get started though, if you are brand new here, please head over to the subscribe button and smash the bajangles out of it and ring the bell. That way you will be notified the next time I drop another fun reaction just like this one. As you all know, I'm, well, I, maybe you all don't know. Maybe you've been living under a rock and you didn't know that I'm completely obsessed with Celine Dion. I'm a huge fan and one of my favorite things to do on this channel is cover all things Celine. As a lot of us know, Ellen ended her show last year in 2022, but the channel is still active. And just a few days ago, they released this clip, which was Celine Dion's first appearance on the Ellen show. And I thought that it'd be fun for us because it was just released to watch that. I haven't even seen this. I don't know if I've even seen this when it aired the first time. I've seen her on Ellen before, but that was when she was wearing like the the ring, remember? She works hard for the money, that clip. Look at this ring, wow. Oh my God. That's real? She works hard for the money. <laughs> so hard for the money. <laughs> so I don't think I've even seen this. So let's go ahead and watch this and I'll give my thoughts. With over 175 million albums sold. 175 million albums. Wow. It's a lot. Our Been first guest is the biggest selling female artist in the world. Please welcome five time Grammy Biggest Award selling winner, female Celine artist Dion. of all time in the world. Oh, she looks gorgeous. Oh, Celine, you're so pretty. Get your dance on, Celine. I love how Celine dances. For someone with such a powerful, like, I guess, emotional, serious voice, she is so silly. And if you ever watch her in concert, she dances, she moves. She gets, I mean, she's being silly and fun here, but she's not that bad, actually. She can move a bit. She's got a little dancer in her. We gotta sing together. Oh, Girl, yeah, good luck with I that. I can dance like you. Yeah, oh yes, you can. I saw you dance. We had quite a uh, fun rehearsal that was when she cool. was here. You, you're just That's amazing. how a real Every vocalist starts you, an interview. In, in Divas, when you, in Las Vegas, when you were singing, you make me cry when you sing. I don't know if it's going to make you cry or laugh. Uh, all right. But today is our 10th year anniversary, my husband and I. Congratulations. Yes. We love Celine and Renee. Okay, let me pause it real quick. Um, she, they mentioned Las Vegas when, I guess, was that the Divas Live Las Vegas where she sang with Shakira and she sang with Anastasia and with Cher. Remember that? Divas Las Vegas? Oh, that was amazing. So, yeah, that's a lot of fun and happy anniversary at this time uh, to you, Celine and Renee, who you married for many, many years after this. That's wonderful. I'm so proud. I don't like it. I, I heard that. I actually did hear that it was your 10th. And, and what, is the, uh, what is the gift? I heard that it was aluminum or something. That's the, the gift. Uh, I don't know if it's uh, it is. paper we looked it up. or aluminum. or I, I had no idea. It's aluminum. aluminum. Maybe it's plastic. No. I have no idea. No, it's, it's no, aluminum. What is it? It's the new aluminum? thing. Aluminum? Okay. Yeah, because there's new aluminum. and old. I've never heard of that. Aluminum. aluminum. <laughs> and uh, so we got you some uh, lovely hats for you and oh. your... Um, <laughs> Yeah. Cool. My grandma used to drink cores. You don't have to put it on because I don't want you to mess your hair up. But it's uh, well, these, maybe I look better. These are handmade. Aww. Yes, Celine. Oh, and it's crocheted. <laughs> that is nice. Isn't that it? is so over the top. Oh, she's got Elvis lip going on. I'm a vegan, you know. Yeah. Yes. That looks well. Uh, that was making you do that. Saying. Thank you very much. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They're nice. They're classy, Thank aren't they? Thank you very much. That's yeah. very sweet of you. They weren't cheap. Yeah. 
<laughs> they weren't cheap. This is real yarn. As expensive as it is. It's real yarn. Yeah. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Now, you must be used to having, uh, did you have hand-me-downs like crazy from, uh, you have, how many brothers and sisters do you have? I have 13 brothers and sisters. Yeah, I'm the 14th. I'm the accident of the family. That's wow. what they call me. Yeah. Do you believe that? A good accident. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Ellen, are you flirting with Celine? I mean, how could you blame? I think we would all flirt with Celine. But uh, I, she's told this story many times about her 13 brothers and sisters and how she was the accident of the family. No, Celine, you were the giant, big surprise, amazing golden goose baby of the of the family. Wait, I just lost my train of thought. <laughs> Gilbert, stop rambling. Watch the interview. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, but I Whatever think so. <laughs> I'm surely happy to be here. Yeah. My dad didn't want to have children. He Joke's on him. He didn't want to have any children. So he thought, I'll just guess, try 13 or 14 and then well, I'll... Well, I guess uh, my mother was wearing the pants. I don't know. Oh. I it, love the hat. Yeah, good. I'm glad. She said a lot I'm of hand-me-downs, like she said. So, uh, so th w what was that like? T I would imagine that's sort of who, what forms you. If you're the youngest of 14, to get attention must be impossible. I've been all my life, and especially as a little girl, still today, but very, very spoiled. But a lot of attention, especially, mm -hmm. uh, being surrounded with so many moms and dads. Uh -huh. uh, they were all like fighting to, who's gonna change my diaper? Like, they were fighting to change my diaper. Believe it, it's uh -huh. true. That's, that's so that's kind of good attention. It's nice, you know? And um, growing in music and in a music environment, all my brothers and sisters are musicians, singers. Mm -hmm. um, my both parents as well. And um, I don't know, it was just kind of to, to have the true values of life. We never had any money. But to grow up with my mother who was cooking for all of us, she's such an amazing cook. And to see all of us at the same table, but my mother, every meal, she used to count one, two, three, four. Let me start again. One, two, three, four, five. Making sure that everyone was there. Wow. And there was a lot, every time we used to have a lot of, you know, every time you, you know, on the, when you set the table, you put a few jars, you know, oh, let's have the pickles tonight, and oh, maybe we'll use some ketchup. Well, we don't have the sweet stuff or the sour stuff. Ah, bring them both. So you don't know. So you bring out a lot of stuff. But every meal, we used to take our forks and spoons and go like, ting, 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 koto, 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 koto. And my dad was like, enough. <laughs> we couldn't hear ourselves. But yeah. it was music all the time, even at meals with the stuff on the table. Oh, it was just wonderful. That sounds Especially fun. surrounded with music, it was great. Yeah. That's a huge table, 14 kids. It's a huge, huge table. And a lot of food. I can't imagine that kind of... You know what we used to do? I think you'll appreciate that. Can I take that bowl? Uh, I yes. Break it. You can do whatever you want. We used to have our meal. Okay. It Flip wasn't it as nice as this. But what was inside was very special. So we used to have our meal. And for dessert time, we couldn't afford to have like 28 or something plates. So we had one plate for each member of the family. But when it was time for dessert time, we used to turn it around. And there's always an edge here. And we used to have our dessert in the middle of the back. Isn't that sweet? That's My very, mother yeah. was so smart. It's very, she very... was very smart. So we used to clean on, on both sides, making sure. <laughs> you know, today it was like putting the dishwasher. Or when we wash, we go like, it's fine. You know, we'll make sure the eggs are out of there. But and where I grew up was like, make both sides. Yeah. I still eat like that. I didn't know anybody else did. I just, <laughs> it's quicker. I don't have to what wait for What was your favorite them. dessert? My favorite dessert, I, I, uh, I What love, could you afford? Cheesecake was the thing that I used to wow, splurge you had on. Some money. No, wow. no, no one, my mother made it. Okay. No, I didn't have money. Okay. I got no money. <laughs> you're broke after yeah. giving to everybody uh, yeah. all those gifts. That's right. Yeah. No way you're broke. <laughs> Comes out of my pocket. All right. We have to take a commercial, but we, I want to talk about your uh, little adorable four-year-old. That picture is incredible. It's going to be four in one month. Oh, my oh. God. He's beautiful. We'll be right back right after this. For Where's the picture? Is that still still? I have to pause little... this because this is funny because those of you that are, like, big fans of Celine, you know that the, when, the, when she came back um, and her son's hair was very long, Ellen gave her grief about it. Remember that? Well, it seems like you're busy with something because you're forgetting to cut your son's hair. Um... <laughs> This yeah, is, right. look at him, he is beautiful, but look at his hair. When are you gonna cut that hair? Do you have a problem with that? No, I don't have a problem. You have a problem with that? I was like, get it, Celine. She had no time for the shade. Um, it's so funny that they're talking about her son right here now. The picture of your, your son, who, who he'll be four. He'll be four there in he one is, month. in your monitors. Look how gorgeous. Wow, he's sweet. And are you wearing his clothes? <laughs> 
all, we almost were the same size, actually. It's yeah. True. He's getting big, and I'm not getting any bigger. Yeah. So, um, oh, but you know, when I gave life to him almost four years ago, I was born. And he gave both of us a life. Um, the stability, um, making a difference. Singing is wonderful. It's a way of expression. I'm enjoying it tremendously. It's fun for me, uh, very touching. And uh, when people come to me sometimes and say, I got married with this song, or I lost someone that I love so dearly, and this song helped me tremendously, it, it, it says to me that I can still do it and, and it's, it's worth it to keep going. Yeah. But to have a family of your own and to know that you make a difference in this person's life, mm -hmm. it's very, very touching to have yeah. children. These pictures, you have a, a new book, Miracle, which is, is beautiful, and these pictures are incredible. Um, and what is her last name? And Geddes. Geddes, Geddes. who, who uh, takes the pictures. Beautiful that pictures. Baby. That is just beautiful. It was a wonderful blessing to be photographed. First of all, a wonderful experience to be uh, uh, working with Anne Geddes. And to have... Uh, actually, this is, can this I, let, me, let me help you. Yeah. This one here. Uh -huh. Like this. Oh. Am I doing it right? Yeah. Oh. Because <laughs> I had so, you laying so. on top of the baby. That, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or, or squishing the baby. That, <laughs> you hold a child I know enough I may not be a mother but I know that's not how you hold them um, and then this is is this and and uh, and Gettys, Gettys. yeah it was wonderful to work with her and um, the way she captures she's not trying to to create it she's capturing the magic and for me it was a wonderful blessing to be photographed to meet the parents, to have those newborns, holding them, smelling their own unique smell, having them so close, feeling their heartbeats. It was a blessing for me. Honestly, this whole project, isn't that sweet? Come on. That's a, yeah, that's, how do they but, get the babies that the baby, young into the, the studios? The baby, and then later, babies. And then she like, adds. Right. Because computers. I wish I would have known that when I was doing my shoot, because I had no idea you could do it <laughs> <laughs> that way. <laughs> All right, the name of the CD is Miracle. Look and, at, um, oh my God! The book is absolutely Ooh. beautiful. That was a genuine laugh. And, Celine did not uh, expect and that. And it's, uh, she was caught off guard. Also, that was so uh, cute. We got a, a real a genuine belly laugh there's from her. There's a DVD. There's, there's a CD. There's, oh, I'm sorry. And, right? This, yes. Yeah, and In then, this book, there's a CD and a DVD. And and also, uh, you have a new perfume. Notes. That, it's called Notes. I, and I, of course uh, it is. I want to put some on. All right, so uh, really, Celine's really going to be good. back uh, later to sing with us. Oh, by the way, everybody in the audience is getting this whole world. Yes! That was fun. The nine minutes is up already. That was so fast. Um, so this was what, 2004, I would say? Because, no, 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 no. RC was born in 2001, right? So if he's four, that would make this 2005, right? And the One Heart album was out in 2003. So 2005, of course, she was in Vegas because she started in 2003. So she was what, what What work was around 2005? Y'all help me out. But I remember this with the long hair like that. Is that where she had the where she changed it up to the corset? Right. That's what I'm thinking. But this was a lot of fun. I loved this. I, I love Celine's interviews. Um, I need to do, actually react to my favorite Celine Dion interview of all time. There's a few of them that are just like some of my favorites. I love her on Larry King. I love her. She's been on there many times, but there's one that I really, really love. There's one where she was, she's been with Barbara Walters a couple of times. There's one I really, really love. But the one that I love the most, spoiler, I don't want to do a spoiler, but you'll have to, well, well, you'll have to check it out and see. You have to stay with me. But if you enjoyed this video, please smash the subscribe button, smash the like button and drop me a comment. Are you a fan of Ellen? Are you a fan of Celine Dion? Do you also just love watching Celine Dion interviews? Like, are you in love with her the way that I am? You could just listen to her talk for hours. Um, if so, I'd love to hear all about it in the comments. Until then, I will see you in the next video. I love you. God bless you. Take good care. Bye.